What's up, chicas? Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is was a request by you guys, my Snapchat fam. I have been lately wearing a minimal slay type of makeup and um, you guys have liked it. You guys have asked for me to do a tutorial and I decided to go ahead and film it for you guys. I'm going to call it my quick, my easy slay. Quick slay, easy slay, whatever you want to call it. Um, I want to say it's easy because it doesn't require a lot of products, but I want to incorporate a slay because when I think of slaying, I'm thinking of you beat that face. You um, went to town and I beat my face. You know, I did the whole um, baking and all that. So that's why I'm going to call it a quick slay. So um, yeah, if you're a mom and you don't barely have time to put makeup on or you normally are late to work or um, whatever and you still want to look presentable and you want to see how I achieve my quick everyday slay makeup look and then go ahead and watch. Okay, so we're going to start off with the primer as usual, the Nivea Post Shape Balm. Any primer you have will do. This is my favorite one. Now we're going to do a lip treatment. I have been obsessing over this thing. This is the uh, Kaplan, Kaplan MD lip mask. I leave it on for three minutes and that's going to help me um, pump up my lips. So I'm going to move on to foundation and I'm mixing the L'Oreal Pro Glow foundation with the cover effects. And here I'm removing it after the three minutes and I'm applying the hydrated um, lip balm that comes with it. My lips feel so smooth and so plump. It's not even funny. So then I move on to foundation and I'm just blending the foundation over my face and I'm moving on to concealer now. Nothing new. This is something that you guys have seen here on my channel before plenty of times. So the H Rewind by Maybelline. I'm applying it all over. I want highlight. Then a little bit of the Kat Von D Locket concealer. This brings me a little more of a highlight on my under eyes. And it helps to stay in place for a while because it's Locket concealer. I'm just blending with my beauty blender, making sure everything is well blended or then the eyes and all over. And of course my eyelids, prepping my eyes. Then I'm moving on to baking. I am setting my concealer with this awesome translucent powder, which I absolutely love. It's the Air Sponge Extra Coverage Translucent Powder. And I'm applying that under my eyes, on my chin, and on my forehead. Then I'm going in with the NYX uh, this is the foundation, powder foundation, and I'm applying it in those areas right there. Helps blend the contour a lot better and helps set my foundation. So I'm using the Benefit Hula Bronzer, and as you can see, I am contouring my face, and I'm going to bring a lot of warmth onto my face. So I contour my face, and then I go ahead and place the gentles and powder on the bottom just to sharpen it up a little bit more, clean up a little bit more. Then I move on to my eyebrows and I pretty much draw out the eyebrows and then I go filling them in little by little and brushing the hair, making sure that everything looks good. Then for the eyes, of course, easy tutorial, I'm using the Hula Bronzer and a crease brush and I'm applying that all over my crease and make sure that everything is well well blended. And then I'm moving on to removing the translucent powder with the NYX banana powder. Making sure that I bring a lot of highlight. Then with that same powder, I am actually applying that to my lid and my brow bone. That's it. That's all I'm doing to the eyes. Honestly. Then I'm using the Gerard Cosmetics Star Pow Powders in this one is Grace and it's very light shimmery highlight and I'm applying that very close to my tear duct and I'm bringing it to the, my tear duct. Then the important part about my makeup, <laughs> it's a lot of mascaras. I am packing, this is my two favorite mascaras and I'm packing a lot of mascara. I'm starting with the Feline Mascara by L'Oreal and I am just pretty much doing a lot of mascara. After the feline, I am working with the Pacifica Stella Gaze Volume and Lengthening Mascara and I'm making sure that all my lashes are coated. And then I'm brushing it out just to make sure that there's no clumps. And if you can see the difference, one with mascara and then the other one's not. So after the mascara, I just went in and uh, grabbed a little bit more of the brown, of bronzer and I'm bringing warmth and definition to my face. 
symbols of my face and my forehead, my nose. And for highlight, I'm using the same star powder, powder by Gerard Cosmetics. And I'm applying that like, yes, babe. Like I want a lot of highlight. Yes. Then a little bit of the Gilded Honey by Laura Geller. And I'm blending everything together. And for the lips, I am using the Hydra Matte Liquid Lipstick in Skinny Dip. And that's it, ladies. <laughs> that is my quick slay makeup look. enjoy this quick slate tutorial um it's what i've been wearing lately like i said it's just very easy i just feel very comfortable because it's a lot of it i do have a lot of coverage but at the same time i'm looking very presentable and i didn't do i didn't go all out so um if you like this type of video don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed to my channel go ahead and subscribe right down there and let me see mm, nope i don't have anything else to say besides thank you for sticking till the end and mwah, this will be blessed precious pearls. I will see you ladies on my next video. Bye.